today's video is sort of going to be a bit of a tutorial of the information video. So now I'm with Chino here, he's tied up actually on the grass so that he can cut the lawn for us a little bit. Um, so I'm going to be doing parts of the pony, so I'm not going to do like the super like, it's kind of more of a beginner's sort of, so you learn. I don't know like the all the different muscles and bones on the inside, I just know some of the main things. Um, so I'm going to just go through it. Um, I don't. I'm gonna, I was going to say that I'm going to start from the head, but then I'll remember when I go back to the head, so I'm not even going to bother. Um, but I'll try and do roughly going along like this. So I think I'll start actually from the back so he can eat with his head and leave him alone for a bit. So we'll start with simple. This is the tail, the like hair, like sort of hair bits. And then at the top there's actually a bone in their tail that goes down to about here. You can kind of feel it. it goes, Chino even goes down here and can feel it. And that's called the dog. And then, so that's like the bone in the tail. And I think, I might be wrong, but I think that comes kind of out there, like spine, when it goes just like it sticks out a little bit. Um, but I'm not 100% sure. So then, this is obviously their like leg, but this kind of lump, kind of like their, what looks kind of like their knee on the back, that's called the hop. Um, and then, the, they're like, feet, kind of this one, basically their feet, they're like solid, they're not like human feet, they're kind of squidgy, they are solid, and those are called hooves. Um, this bit here where the, like the um, kind of fur goes a different direction, so it goes into as well, that's called the flank. Um, this sort of big belly kind of middle bit here, this is called the barrel. Uh, I think. Um, this is the bum. Um, what else? So their elbow is here. So that's their elbow, just like us. Then this is their knee. And their shoulder is up here. So this is their shoulder. And then this sort of lump, you can see they've got kind of a lump, kind of where their mane starts, it's kind of just here, that's called the wither. Um, then, all the hair on their neck, oh, I'm getting myself tangled. Yes, sorry. This is the mane. So like the hair here is the mane. And then onto the face. I'm not sure if he'll let me, because um, it's quite difficult keeping his head up. These are the ears. Um, this sort of fringe, this fringe like bit here is called the forelock. Um, I remember at my first pony club they said, do you know what this is called? And I was like, you know the fringe? And they were like, no, it's a forelock. Yeah, sorry. Uh, that's the eye. I'm not going to touch it because I don't think he'd like to look inside it. Um, this is his cheek. And then here, um, they've got like a bone here that's called the, I think it's called the projecting cheekbone. So that's quite interesting. Um, this whole kind of bit here is called the muzzle. Yes, you're trying to bite me, I know you're hungry. Um, this is the nostril. I'm not going to poke his nostril. It's alright. Come on. And this is his mouth. I'm not going to stick my finger in his mouth because I'll probably lose a finger. Alright. Um, I'm going to let him eat now because I don't think he likes me taking him away from his food. That's what he loves the most, his food. Um, what else? I don't want to like say any and then I get it wrong because um, I don't like to say it wrong to you. Um, I've done hot. Let's do some of the hoof bits. So I haven't actually picked out his feet yet. I'll do that quickly. Up for his hoof is clean to show you. Um, Right, so if you look closely, oh, if you look closely on their hooves, you'll see that there's this little triangle here. That's called the frog, and uh, I think that's what like kind of takes the pressure when they land. But I'm not 100% sure. These are called the um, heel bulbs, and this is the I think it's called the frog groove or the hoof groove it's something groove i think or groove of 
I think it's the frog groove, but I'm not 100% sure. This is the sole, so like this kind of bit in here. And Chino, oh Chino, I can't hold your weight. This bit here, this like kind of metal bit, is a horseshoe. Not all horses have horseshoes, but Chino has them on his front feet. So yeah, and then uh, you also get very nice dirty hands, which is pretty nice. I'm going to wipe them on the glass. You know what, I'm not even going to bother because I'm going to get dirty anyway. Um, so yeah, those are kind of the main, the main bits. Um, so yeah, that is, I think that's it. I know it's a very short video, but I got a request to make a video like that so um and i'm very sorry she was very dirty um i he was wearing this rug and i thought it was waterproof and then i took it off him and i realized i'm gonna need to get some more rug waterproofer because that rug is not waterproof so he's pretty wet still it like it's waterproof on this bit and a bit on his bum and here but the rest is wet so here he's like all wet and then and I can't really brush him when he's wet like that because it'll like rub the dirt into him so it's just kind of going to let his natural horse fluff completely dry. I almost forgot the words there. So anyway, thank you for watching. I would lift up his head. I don't know which thing to use. Um, I would lift up his head but he doesn't like me lifting up his head, taking him away from his grass. So. I'm just going to end the video here, so um, thanks for watching, I hope this was useful, I know it's very basic, but yeah, every bit counts, maybe if there's someone who's learnt that much about horses, it's probably useful, so yeah, if you enjoyed, like and subscribe, thanks for watching, see you in the next one, bye!